it's hoped that it could be the future of green energy. Phantom Dynamics is poised to revolutionize the way we harness wind power. Imagine a world where the relentless force of the wind isn't just a natural phenomenon, but a sustainable energy gold mine. All thanks to the groundbreaking technology of Vendom's wind turbines. With the upcoming launch of two distinct turbine sizes catering to various energy needs, Vendom Dynamics is set to unleash a wave of innovation. If you are new here, please consider subscribing for more videos on renewable energy. Clicking the like button will help the algorithm show this video to more people. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to click the like button and don't forget to share this video with anyone you think will find it useful. As this Dalek-like structure spins in the East Coast breeze, it is generating clean energy. This is only a trial run, but it's creating huge excitement. Venom Dynamics introduces two distinct turbine sizes, catering to varied applications. The 2-meter and 4-meter versions offer scalable solutions for different energy needs. The smaller variant, with its unobtrusive design, finds a perfect fit atop industrial buildings, warehouses, and similar large-scale facilities. The larger 4-meter turbine promises enhanced power generation, ideal for larger industrial settings. Both turbine models, engineered to be space-efficient, incorporate advanced omnidirectional technology. These turbines can capture wind energy from all directions without the need for constant repositioning. The 2-meter model, with approximate dimensions of 2.9 meters in width and 2.6 meters in height, showcases the company's commitment to compact and powerful design. Furthermore, future plans include the launch of a residential version, demonstrating the company's vision for varied applications. We're all used to the sight of huge offshore turbines, but this really is something different and it could even be scaled down to power an individual home. In a building edge application, the estimated annual energy production for the two meter turbine is up to 6,100 kilowatt hours at a wind speed of eight meters per second. The larger four meter turbine promises a staggering 18,800 kilowatt hours at the same wind speed. These numbers reflect the efficiency and reliability of Venom's wind turbines in harnessing wind power for significant energy outputs. The adaptability of Venom's turbines is their key strength, designed to perform optimally across a range of installation environments. Whether on an industrial rooftop in a vibrant city or in various other environmental conditions, these turbines are engineered to deliver efficient and consistent clean energy solutions. While the initial turbine sizes cater to the industrial sector, commercial buildings, and large-scale developments, Vendom Dynamics is envisioning the future adaptation of these turbines for residential use. The company's commitment to evolving their technology to meet the needs of households demonstrates their dedication to making sustainable energy accessible to everyone. One remarkable advantage of Vendom's wind turbine technology is its compatibility with existing solar panel installations. Seamlessly integrating with solar setups, the turbines complement solar energy, addressing the intermittency of solar power and providing consistent energy generation. The prices of Vendom's turbines will be set individually for each market upon their commercial launch, accessible through the company's sales representatives in each country. The pricing is expected to be competitive, offering affordability in line with the technology's benefits. The much-anticipated launch is scheduled for the first quarter of 2024, commencing initially in the UK, paving the way for a groundbreaking entry into the renewable energy market. Regardless of which direction the wind's blowing, what it does, it actually sucks the wind into the center part of the turbine and actually pushes it up into the actual generator in the turbine itself. So almost acting like a bit of a wind tunnel. So what actually what the, the wind speed that goes in is a little lower than the wind speed that actually comes out of the top of it. So it actually accelerates the wind. Vendom Dynamics, originating from Norway, stands as a testament to innovative technology and sustainable solutions. DSR Energy, the co-owner of Venom Dynamics Group, plays a pivotal role in realizing the company's vision for a carbon emissions-free future. 
Their shared commitment to environmental responsibility and green energy is evident in the strategic partnerships forged and the groundbreaking technology introduced. With its bracing breezes, the East Coast is an ideal testing ground. So expect to see more of these machines should the trial be deemed a success. What actually are we looking at? Fantastic. So this is uh, the new style of uh, wind turbines that have been launched by Venton Dynamics. Uh, they're omnidirectional, which means it doesn't make a difference in what direction the wind is blowing. It's generating energy. Um, and, and the aim is this is a new way, a new form of uh, generating energy. So it's not very big, is it? And we're used to wind turbines being meters in the air and huge blades on it. It's not very big, and it's going now, isn't it? It is indeed. Yeah. It's actually it's silent. I can't hear it. Absolutely. So the, the, this is the uh, two meter turbine, uh, which is likely to be used for small to medium businesses um, and for groups of homes. Our the theory is that a super turbine like this could power a number of homes. Um, the larger so how, ones. How many? So I know you can't. You haven't got the data yet. So, so roughly, I'm talking. One per house, four houses, or? so potentially up to four houses. Wow! Powered by a single turbine like this, yes. And, and, it, it, it is tight, isn't it? It, it is. It's absolutely tight. And um, you can get ones for you're planning on doing ones for individual homes, are you? Um, so it's it's, it's a fun cut. Yeah. Um, and, and would, would that be even smaller than this? Yes, yeah, so the aim is to have a smaller version, which is going to be a domestic version, uh, yeah. potentially to sell it off the roof um, and power power home. So. If this is working, because you can see it's working now, because, oh, we should have said, I do apologise, we're actually on the end of Skegness Pier, and Skegness is bracing. You can't get more bracing than it is today. In fact, some would say, and I looked at my weather app, it's officially so bracing it's bloody cold. Yes. That's how bracing it is. So, and it's working perfectly. So, you say a roughly four houses, what does, give me that in data, are we talking one kilowatt, half a kilowatt, how much is it? I can't get over how small this is. So how much energy can it actually give me? Um, so again, we've, we've got to be careful to be able to quote yeah, yeah, the actual yeah, data yeah, figures just, itself. Just, just um, ideas. But I mean, let, let's say the average UK home uh, uses about 4,000 kilowatt hours uh, per year. Yeah. Um, so it gives you an idea. So if we're looking at three to four, then uh, that, that gives you a picture of what we're what, 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 what sort of expecting from a turbine. So give it in, in layman's terms, as, as, as close as you can. I know not an exact thing, but does it put out? 500 watts. So, 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 so if the wind is blowing well enough, yeah. uh, then we're looking at over 10,000. Uh, so that's it. Well, thank you very much. And by the way, we should have said that you won't see these anywhere else. But there's actually two in our part of the world. There's one here on Skegness Pier, and there's one down on, on Spalding on a, a food factory. But if this does what Ravi says he, he thinks it will do. I think here we're looking at the future. This is wind turbines, the future. And the fact you can have a smaller one on your home, maybe in futures every home will have a wind turbine. Well, Ravi, it's been a pleasure. Thank you for coming Thanks down so and having a chat today. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you.